Now, the Wabash Valley's most accurate and reliable newscast continues with Storm Team 10's Joseph Dames. Well, good Tuesday afternoon. I hope you're having a great start to your afternoon now. Still morning in Illinois, but we're almost right there. Storm Team 10 Storm Tracker, we will be tracking some showers and some thunderstorms as we head through the day today, but so far so good. So get out there, enjoy some of the weather. It's uh, Champaign to Rockville to Terre Haute. As you can see, nothing in the way there. No showers or thunderstorms. There are a few that are starting to spark up off to the east of 65 there, but those will not be bothering us. We will be watching for development as we head through our afternoon and into the evening hours as we start to see a little bit of sunshine, which could start relating to a few thunderstorms. So right now, most of that is off to the east. We look off to the northwest, nothing really going on, but this is where I do expect it to start developing as we do head through the course of our afternoon. And that is why we do have a slight risk for severe weather for today. So we can have some gusty wind, some hail even incorporated in those thunderstorms that will be embedded in those showers for today. This is the whole yellow region. So northern Vermilion as well as Park and portions of Illinois. Not as strong, not expecting those stronger thunderstorms. But if you're making way further off to the south for today, Green County, Sullivan, all the way down to Knox County, even into Illinois there. We could start to see some more stronger storms develop as we head through our day today. How about tonight, though? Let's take a quick look at some astronomy fun. We do have Venus and Jupiter. I'm sure you heard all about it. Those will be coming really close together tonight and start to align. You catch that right around 921, which is our sunset. So maybe when it gets a little bit darker than that, if we don't have any clouds out there, you might get to see this nice rare sighting as we head through uh, the overnight into the nighttime hours. So let's zoom on in though. Let's take a travel through space real fast. Here we are across the Midwest and you can see there's some showers and thunderstorms, some clouds off to the west, some drier conditions here. And without those clouds in the region, that's something that we will be concerned about because that's going to develop that energy that we need for those stronger storms for today. And that's what I think is going to happen as we get into our afternoon evening. We could see some spark on up. Temperatures in the upper 70s right now will be pushing the lower 80s for today. 79 in Linton, 79 in Robinson off to the north there. Rockville at 76 and Paris, a pair of sevens there at 77 degrees. We'll go through hour by hour on the future cast. Notice for our early afternoon looking pretty good. Our RPM here, this is one of our in-house models, is showing some showers and thunderstorms developing as early as 3 o'clock, 2 o'clock in Illinois, especially off to the northeast. So some of these could pack a little bit of a punch to them, have some lightning, some thunder, and even some heavy rain and some strong wind. It continues as we head through the afternoon and evening hours. Here's 5 o'clock for dinner time. And a lot of those thunderstorms, as you'll notice, are developing in the Indiana side of things. If you're off to the southwest here in Illinois, not so much, but uh, I'm not going to leave you off the hook either. I want to think that we'll have some showers and thunderstorms to the southwest too for this afternoon and evening. Future cast come tomorrow morning. Looks like our morning commute should be okay. So when you're heading out the door, probably don't need the umbrella. A nice calm start to your day tomorrow. A few clouds working their way on in. But then the rain will really pick up in activity as we head through our afternoon tomorrow, really engulfing the whole region by the time we reach our afternoon, bringing in those lunchtime hours, continuing through as we go through our Thursday. We still have the flood warning ongoing. A lot of the river stages right around 25 feet in Clinton, 22 feet here in Illa, uh, Terre Haute. And most of those are right around that mark for this time of the year. Seven day forecast Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Temperatures cooling off slightly, mainly because we're not going to have a lot of sunshine for our Wednesday. Temperatures right around 76 degrees. 78 for our Friday for the 4th of July. Fun on Friday night and into Saturday. We might be dealing with some rain showers on Friday. Saturday definitely looks like one of the better days, Brittany, where we will have some more drier conditions to really just enjoy maybe a barbecue and have fun with the family and friends on our 4th of July. 